We'll, we'll see music, what 2024 yeah, brings us. But movies. Yeah. Movies. So oh, you want to start it off, Nick? 2023 was filled with fantastic movies. Awesome. And I will start it off. We're going to talk about favorite fucking movies of 2023. Yeah. I'm running with Godzilla Minus One. Mm, I still haven't seen it. Wait, that was that was last year? <clears throat> yeah. It came out in December. Um, they've been prolonging it in the American box office because it's been doing so well. Oh, uh, that's dope. Um, so, which is awesome because it was only a budget of seventy million dollars, and boy, oh boy, Marvel could learn a thing or two. Damn. <clears throat> okay. Why? Well, all right. We we ain't gonna wait. We gonna wait. Well, we're gonna say that. The, no, because actually, like yo, CGI in a seventy million dollar budget. Ayo, you got a two hundred million dollar budget movie. It'd be it a like hundred bad movies. It'd be a hundred yeah. bad movies out there, but somehow the MCU comes in. Yeah, <laughs> because they're in movies. the forefront. Of what they asked. of the movie? Oh, me, I'm sorry. Wait a oh. minute. Yeah, all right. Yeah, you got him. You got him. Yeah. No, for real though. For real though. Seventy million dollars and what they did with that movie was fantastic. Oh yeah, yeah. And Are like a lot of enough? a lot of that uh a lot of word of mouth with that movie too because like it was all Twitter basically. Bas- yeah, basically. All basically. Which Twitter. is kind of like good for which is like real good for a movie. Yeah. Because like I did not see like any like trailers or marketing for it or anything. No. All I heard was you know somebody telling me yo go see Godzilla. Yeah. yeah, that was really. And they for the I don't know anymore because Iron Claw and Poor Things came out. Mm. But like when that movie came out, it was the highest rated movie on IMDb from 2023. Okay, so can Godzilla I throw? Was? Yeah, and that's beating Oppenheimer and Barbie and Spider Man and Spider Man too. Yeah, yeah. and Team Manatee and Guardians and wow. Guardians. Wow. And, yeah, and, we had a wow. good year for movies, mm-hmm. bro. Yeah, I I don't think I saw you know, a movie man. that I didn't like. I didn't see that but I didn't see a lot of movies, so I, see a lot of movies. I think that's our fault. We should have went, we should, we should yeah, we'll, we'll, we we'll, went to more movies. Yeah, we'll sure. do that. We got, yeah, we got mad and just separated. Yeah, Man, I didn't we did. separate. Well, y'all live together, so yeah, we went and seen some movies. We I'm still waiting for him to go see Iron Claw, but I, yeah, we got to see Iron Claw for sure. Mm. Okay. Yeah, we got to see so that. Yeah, that would be my best for this. So Godzilla one. minus one. Godzilla minus one. The black and white version comes so, wait, out January twenty sixth. What was the minus one? Yes. Um. To be honest with you, I don't know. Hmm. Minus, I mean, minus one nigga. Sorry, <laughs> it takes place in Japan in what the, the 1940s. So, because <laughs> Godzilla, <'cause> Godzilla <laughs> steps on people. Okay, yeah. all right, okay. all right, all right. Okay. Okay. Uh, Mike, what's That's, your favorite yeah, movie? Mike, yeah. what are you going with? My favorite movie. I don't like. It's hard to say because I don't. I don't. I didn't really see a movie that I didn't like. Um, and and it's really. By the time that I get to the end of a year, the year felt feels very long. Right. So like I can't, I I end up mixing it up. Yeah. So I don't even That's remember. That's why I had what, to just look it up. I just had to look up. A yeah. I I know I loved Barbie. Barbie was fire. Uh, I I fucking loved Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Bro, that was that yeah. movie was just good got as that on fuck. Steam. Yeah. Mm. That was good I've seen as that. fuck. Yeah. Um, and. Was Spider Man last year? Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. was Spider Man yeah. was fucking crazy too. Mm-hmm. But beautiful. that fucking like I was not. Ex- we didn't know there was going to be a two part. Yeah, thing, no. So I was I like, did not at all. By the time after, I did. <laughs> I did. Actually, first of all, you all should know because when they first re- announced the movie, they well, said actually, part one, and then they I did said not, part two. I, I nobody ever saw that. Yeah. Nobody saw that. God God reveal, nobody. We're a podcast Wait. that Shut talks up. about it, but we're not going to learn about it, guys. All right. Bullshit. All right. Twitter. I'm the only. Yeah, one. I was about to say that's the I did only like, thing I got. I got. I saw on Twitter was just somebody saying the ending was unbelievable. So as it started, like we're getting on like the two hour mark, I was like, all right. Any of these could be endings, and any of these would be crazy endings right now. But when is it going to wrap up? Yeah, that's why I was like, "How is right, it going to wrap up?" Because he still had a lot of shit to then, do. That's, yeah. what I, that's, that's why. That's well, why I was like, "Oh, because I didn't, I didn't know." <laughs> because, that shit. Like I didn't know that that was how it was going to end. So I was like, "Yeah, what is going on?" I'm like, "I'm like, how are they going to wrap this yeah, up from this exactly. point?" And then, uh, and then it was just ended, and I was like, yeah. "Oh, okay, that's fucking cool." And that soundtrack was. <sighs> Fire, God, bro. Shit, oh yeah, fire. the soundtrack got was. On you got it on vinyl? Yeah. Yeah, I uh, got the cut. Target version. The bitch is from sweet. The, from what I can remember right now, I would say Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles nice. for their Attack so. on Titan reference. That's so. That's <laughs> they had a lot of the shirt too. They, they they did a lot of references. A lot of Attack on Titan. They did a lot of anime. Yes, uh, we got the best. <laughs> yeah. The bacon, egg, and cheese. Eh? The, the bacon, egg, and cheese. Bacon, egg, and cheese. Did you uh? Did you see Oppenheimer? No, and I wanted to. Right, yeah, yeah. That Oppenheimer shit. Oppenheimer was delicious. Oppenheimer, I can't mm-hmm. wait to see that because mm-hmm. I was right. Like there is, there is a lot of quotes from that that I've yeah. seen that I was bro. like, bro, 
Me and Jaleer did the double feature for that shit. Yeah, yeah that shit. Yeah, same. Yep, we did the Barbie night. Yeah, because I, yeah. I did that too. Yeah, because I'm I I showed up for Barbie, for Barbie but yeah. we didn't see. I didn't I didn't make it to Oppenheimer. Barbie was mad. That ending, but yeah, I would say crazy. I would I mean, say oh, uh, no spoilers. I, yeah, I would say Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Nice. Okay. Teenage Mutant Turtles was great. Yeah. I fuck. I'm so glad I got that. Yo, that it was, was fucking fantastic. It was better than I expected. It because like I was just so like. I wouldn't say tarnished with Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movies, but like it yeah. kind of gave the, me a bad taste. The Michael Bay balls. ones, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's how I felt like with like Godzilla, like with how the other Godzillas were going. I was like, I don't really care for the new Godzillas now. Yeah. But then I heard about how it was, and I was like, all right, how it's going now. Minus one is great. The one, they- Legacy Universe is okay. It's okay. The older ones are great though, Godzilla. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But the Michael Bay Ninja Turtle movies were. Go ahead. So, all right, <laughs> you know what? hold on. Said, I'm gonna defend ahead. them for two seconds because okay. I like what they did with the Ninja Turtles. In Bro, the they movie. made a wait, Pepsi wait, 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 machine wait. blow up. Wait. That doesn't oh, bother me. No, Michael Bay makes everything there's blow. There's more up. than one Michael Bay team. Yeah, there's two. two. There's yeah. two. All right, but yeah. the thing that I like about them <laughs> was two towers. Is that he get? Oh God, this is our first episode back. I oh, gotta no. start it off. Sorry, why are you all bringing right. up a Lord of the Rings reference okay. now? Thanks for the same. <laughs> Not okay. a problem. No, it's loosely. 9-11 is loosely based off 9-11. Okay, all right. I mean, uh, Lord right. of the Rings. Lord of the Rings. <laughs> but well, we'll get, it's a whole, I'll tell you I that know about on. that, too. Okay. Yeah, I told I you. All right. You but, no, in the Michael Bay one, the Ninja Turtles have their own personalities. They all look, they're like, Raphael's big as fuck because he works out, and Donatello's like really scrawny because clearly he doesn't work out. Like that was I like that aspect oh, so like of the those character designs. Yes. Okay. And like they have their own personality look wise in general. I like that. Strider looked cool. Yeah. He looked pretty sweet. Mm-hmm. That's it. Yeah. That's it. I will give them that and that's it. I mean, some of the fight scenes were kind of like edited bad. Like, cause I thought we were talking nice things. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> some of the fight scenes were kind of edited bad. <laughs> I, would, Lear, yeah. I mean, I agree with you though. Lear, what's your favorite? Yeah. All right, my bad. Sorry. Yeah, my favorite movie. I am. I didn't even think about that. If I say the Marvels, are y'all gonna be mad? No, good. It wasn't the Marvel. I was about to say, <laughs> I'll be disappointed. Yeah, exactly. Uh, my you, favorite, whatever my your favorite, favorite movie is, of twenty twenty three, it might be. Um, bro, I really did like Oppenheimer. No cap, I really did. Yeah, but I really like Guardians. Like Whoa, I saw, I think okay. we, I think oh, we saw shit, Guardians. About Guardians about three times. I think we saw, yeah, like I think we saw that shit like three times. Yeah, yeah. And the first time Nick left us, you well, you cried every time. I couldn't stand there and watch that. I can't watch my best friend cry, bro. Oh man, I was a baby so, in the yeah. theater when I first watched. Bro, that I, watched I was a baby, cry. like yeah. half. Uh, you ever half watched? The movie I was crying. Yeah, you want? Uh, yeah, you want to go mm. watch Matt cry? Yeah. I mean, if I can solve the issue, yeah. The movie oh. is the issue. What are you gonna <laughs> do? Rip up the fucking <laughs> the movie. Real? You the son of a bitch. <laughs> But no, Guardians Three was really good. The way that they wrapped everything up, I, there yeah. was some stuff in there that I thought was going to happen. They kind of had it like Marvel is really good. In the, not Marvel, the MCU James Gunn. is really good at making fucking trailers and thinking oh, they're okay, thinking saying. this shit is going like, oh yeah, this, yeah. This, yeah. It, uh, like hey, you man, feel like this is it doesn't like, happen. This is what's going to happen. Exactly. Yeah. I think he did yeah. that good in the movie. Oh no, 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 like I feel like he he foreshadowed. Every character's death. Mm-hmm. Like if he was like, oh, this. Oh, wait. Spoiler. Sorry, but he foreshadowed so much that I was like, you know, I think any of these are gonna happen. And then, yeah. I mean, he did. And like the the things that like when Guardians first like was announced, and everyone was like, yo, in the first one the logo was this color, and oh yeah, fucking uh, what's his face died, and the second one the logo was this color, and then Yondu died. Oh, yeah. and they're like, oh, the third yeah. one the logo is this color. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Actually, colors are that. We definitely thought someone was dying. Oh yeah, well, you gotta blame the fans because that's why Doctor, you know, Dirty Sprite Two didn't do good. Wait, wait do loved- good in what sense? Uh, expectations. Yeah, I was about to say Ruby. because everyone Man, ruined it for themselves. Right now. I'm not about to do this right now. Yeah, we are. Okay, okay no, we're not. Because fuck that movie. This is Great. not but the point of what, <laughs> what we're do doing. Mean, <laughs> I love that movie. We're not I feel like I'm in a day. popular opinion. So you got Guardians movie. Three is your Guardians Three or Spider Man? Okay, both. Yeah, because I really uh, bro, like both delicious as fuck. Bro, the the yeah. thing about Spider Man was just the thing about Spider. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. The thing about Spider Man <laughs> is the 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 way that the the music played into. The way the music played into like just like the scenes and everything. Yeah. Yeah. And the emotional toll on everything. And also like, bro, if I'm seeing a thousand Spider Mans, I'm there. Regardless. I don't care. So yeah. real quick. Go ahead. You don't never mind. No. Uh, no, no, no. Because it has to do with two thousand twenty four. Okay. So no. Okay. But when we get on twenty four, we'll talk about that. Okay. Man. But yeah. All Man. right. What you got, my guy? So 
I'd say out of all the movies, mm-hmm. Barbie was the one that like blew my expectations. Because right. when I saw the trailers for Barbie and like what it was about, I thought it was just going to be, you know, kind of a gimmicky movie about like just selling Barbie pretty much. It's like, oh, we got these characters that kind of look like these characters and just some funny, goofy movie. Right. But then it ended up being like one of the best experiences I ever had with the comedy, the messages, the yeah. emotions. Yeah. And then... Ryan fucking Gosling as Ken. Oh, he killed that. Shit. He did I, I he mean, it just that just out saying it. I don't think there could have been a single other person that like did it better. Yeah, yeah that I man so. like. And I, they had other Kens in the movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah and yeah, all the other did. Kens were amazing. They too. were great, but, but they were no stole, Ryan. Yeah, yeah, he stole the fucking show. But I did the Barbenheimer, and after I saw Oppenheimer, I was like, yeah, overall, Oppenheimer is probably the best movie I've seen. But at the end of the day, it's got to be beyond the well, like, beyond the Spider Verse, th- or I mean, no, across the Spider Verse, because I'm. I love Spider-Man. Everything about it was perfect. The art, the music, like Gwen's world in general Ooh. was one of my favorite yeah. water paints ever. Yeah. Just that was all dope. the emotions, like it was so artistic. Like yeah, when he hugged, uh, when it, she hugged yes. her dad, it like got pink. And then Ooh. when he found out that she was Spider-Woman, every shot that it went to him, it was a different color background. It was different like shading on his face. It showed like the police lights and then it showed yeah. like other stuff. And then like, Later, when he she came out to him, or no, when he came out saying like, "Oh, I quit my job," and she had that speech. Came out. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> when he when she said that and like he accepted her, the, the background like got like so beautiful, and that's just like yeah. Gwen's world. Not even talking about like everything. The attention else. to detail, yeah. matching it the was color just with the too emotion. perfect. And I love like how Julia was saying, "I love Spider Man. I don't care what you give me, Spider Man. I'm gonna watch it." Yeah. And absolutely, absolutely loved it. I absolutely love that. So that was my favorite. I agree. I mean, great fucking 2023. Crazy with movies. Crazy yeah, year for movies. Yeah, 2023 was a good, good with year that. for a lot of stuff. Yeah. I wish I could remember more of it. Like, mm. I don't remember I, shit. It's crazy because some of these movies I forgot came out in 2023. Yeah. Like Guardians. Yeah, that's I forgot. What, yep. I forgot about I forgot Guardians. Spider-Man. And Guardians was good and I still forgot. It was amazing. Well, no, yeah. they're all really good. It's just there's that it many good just, fucking that, yeah. movies. Yeah. And we still got to watch yep. fucking Poor Things, Iron Claw, and then the uh, new uh, studio. The new Studio Ghibli movie. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, yeah. About that too. yeah. still gotta watch that. Ooh, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, and that's um, what's his face's uh, first Robert, time doing audio. Robert Pattinson. Robert Pattinson. Yeah. This is his first time doing voice acting. Yeah, mm-hmm. I heard that he, he did crazy. some of it on like voice memo. Yeah, he did it on his <laughs> phone. But they said he did the best. Oh yeah, of course. They said he did the fucking best. It doesn't even sound. And I think he said. It, it I, I think they said it only took him two days. Damn. Wow, for real? Do all his lines, yeah. yeah that's crazy. Get, you get paid, young nigga, get paid. Get paid. He's like an artist and actor that can like paid. lock in and just get <laughs> another get level paid. of like focus. Yeah. At least from the things that I see. He's super do. underrated. Yeah. I haven't super watched um, Lighthouse, but Ooh. I've seen like a lot of so, like, bro, seen so clips good. from it. favorite movie. One of my favorite yeah, movies. Yeah, he wishes he was there with them. Bro, William yeah, Defoe. Yeah. Willem. Will, Willem. Willem. Yo, Willem. At my house is William. All right. All right. That boy. That boy can act his ass off. Yeah, Willem Dafoe is insane. I, um, he can literally. I seen it, it was just one movie where he played. He played like a thief, and it literally was just him the whole movie. He can carry a movie by himself. What was that one movie? What was that one movie we really watched? Mm. Where uh, the uh, it was about the two brothers, and Willem Dafoe was like oh, a gay Boondock detective, Saints. bro. Oh, that oh, okay. shit was hilarious. Saints Saints the bro. Shit. <laughs> the, he says a word that we cannot say on air, but like. Because he was, he was a gay yeah. detective, but he's laying in bed with a guy, yeah. and then they call him into the office, and the like, you know, like in those fucking scenes where like the the guy gets a call, and then he's laying in bed with his girl or whatever, and then he has to go. Yeah. And so it's that, but then the guy touches him. He's like, "Get the fuck off me!" <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I ain't that gay. <laughs> well, maybe we'll, uh, we'll when our yeah. other cast member Antonio gets here, he can say it. Uh, no, no, uh, oh, uh, yeah. no one can say it. No one can say it. <laughs> not, we gotta look at what report you to HR. It's not like the N word. <laughs> yeah, like I could. You say can't say it if you are one. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. So uh, <laughs> that's a thing. That was from a Burt Kreischer, Kreischer, whatever the fuck. Doesn't yeah, make it right. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's calling everybody the N word, <laughs> nerd. <laughs> All right, oh, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna move I'm on the this worst. segment to uh, which was the worst. Which was the worst movie that you seen? Don't twenty twenty three. We're gonna start with Matt this time. Okay, I Ant Man. 
worst? Goddamn. Uh, I, like I haven't watched too I I'm in the same boat as you where I haven't watched too many movies. The only movies that I really watched was like hyped up ones. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, I'm going to watch any Marvel movie. Mm-hmm. Damn, man, I was so disappointed. I was, I really was, there's not really much parts that I liked about it other than the effects. It was just so, there were so many moments, and this is why I don't like Future Diary, too. <laughs> Fuck no, no. Fuck you. Throw yeah, 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 throw it in there. There was a moment, there were so many moments before anything happened, before any, like, bad stuff happened, where Hope, or was it, is it Hope, the yeah. mom? Yeah. Or, okay, she could have just said, hey, guys, there's a, being there that's very scary let's not like let's not mess with this easy done when they get there the fact tell that she them was hiding it was do it. really stupid it was just like, i will they're agree with that pushing that it and then it felt like star wars i was like they're just ripping off star wars at this point with like some like get like empire literally and then like it just it, i was just like i'm not right. feeling it and then it was a lot for the like climax star for the climax i was like okay like king's like beating his ass he's doing what he needs to kill him and then you're telling me scott lang started actually punching Kang and actually hurt him? Hey, he like, could punch him and hurt him. He, no, he's not going to win the fight. But, and he did. Like, come on, like, <laughs> His girl <laughs> saved him. He got and beat the fuck and up. then it's like, they could, did. I'm now, I'm somebody that, built. I kind of <laughs> like when things uh, have a, an effect from it or repercussions or there's a like negative from it. Like, oh man, we went through all this for this to happen and we understand and it's sad. The fact that the way that it ended, I was like, wow, it really would have been better if there was more bad stuff that happened instead yeah. because they made it just happy and it was like, oh, now we're back. Well, mm-hmm. I'm going to build on yeah. what you were saying because also, like, I did not like the fact that, first of all, in the movie, he was always like, you know, I did this, I saved the world. And they like, oh, you get it, you saved the world. Yeah. Bro, if they would have made they him die at the him. end, all right, no, and then all made, right, like, Casey and the and then I agree. appreciate him more, it would have it hit 10 times harder. It would have hit ten times harder. Yeah, but I, I mean, yeah, it, uh, did nah, it, but I it, like it would have been that weird. It kind of would have been weird if they killed them too, because they were like, um, or at least trap them there. Trap them. That's yeah. right, that, exactly that. <laughs> trap them in the like happen. I agree. Yeah. I think both death. of them should have been <laughs> stuck in there, and then that keeps them for reserve to yeah. be like pop out of nowhere and be like, "Hey guys, I'm here, and I'm actually going to save stuff again." Yeah, yeah. Like that would have been cool. But then the fact that they got back and it was pretty much like a happy ending, I was like, "Oh, this big scary movie that I was like anticipated." Now, I can compare that to Guardians because we, you know, said the same thing. But the Guardians has there was repercussions for the stuff. There were stakes, and there was like yeah. at the end, Plus, that's the end of a story. Yeah, like with Ant right. Man, there wasn't like it's a trilogy, but like. We're continuing with yep. that character. Yeah. Where Guardians, that was it for them. Yeah. That was yeah. the end of the story. So a happy conclusion is a good conclusion for That's them. That's very true. Especially since it's a sad fucking story. I was about to say, like, as much as I cried and seen the way well, that like, ended, even like, like, yeah. like what he just said, well, like the beginning of Guardians is a repercussion because he <laughs> stole them fucking batteries in, what was it, two? In the beginning yeah, of two. two. Yeah. And they yep. sent out on Warlock. That's the beginning of Guardians. Yeah. So, yeah, they I, yeah, they really dropped the ball with Ant-Man. Mm, dropped the ball with Ant-Man. Yeah. yeah. So you got, yeah. Mine's leave the world behind on Netflix. Okay. Is that the Obama one? Excuse yeah. me. Yeah. One Obama's. Obama's exactly. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah uh, yes. Yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> everyone that's every I've, I'm still supposed to watch that, but like everyone yeah, that's too. talked to me about it has said that the ending was God. Bro, awful. I mean, they built up this thing of like they built up anticipation and all this other stuff just to just to be like, you know what? I don't know how we're gonna end this shit. What yeah. is this movie? I've never the movie. The movie is on Netflix. It's called Leave the World Behind. It's with Mahershala Ali, Ethan Hawke, uh, Julia Roberts, and I don't know the other girl. Kevin Bacon's oh, in there. Kevin Who's Bacon Kevin? is in there. Kevin Bacon. Kevin Bacon yeah, is in there. Small he's a redneck. Oh, nice. Kevin well, Bacon. Nice. What the fuck? Yeah, he's oh, like a dude. I always get <laughs> him, and, him and Ethan Hawke confused every time. Mm-hmm. How? Yeah. They're white. I yeah. Ooh, but, I, uh, just hit, I just hit the low cut. Boy, that that made a difference. If you're listening, you just heard that low cut difference. Mm. All right. Oh, anyway. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, it means cool. you know, it means when you get hit in the dick. Yeah. Right. My, my bad, Lear. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. Anyway, yeah. The move well, the movie was like it was building into this like ending or like epic like uh reveal of what the fuck is going on. Yeah. yeah. And it kind of like fell flat on his face with that. I still don't know what the movie's about. Just the movie is kind of like it's, it's kind of like um a terrorist attack. It's, okay. Yeah, it's a, a, ter- cool. a terrorist attack happens. That's cool. But a cyber one. Oh, that's even cooler. But they don't explain it right. Uh-huh. <laughs> they don't really explain it right. It's just one scene where like 
Teslas just drive up and yeah. block the road. Oh, I've seen that clip. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I know what you're talking yeah, about. The movie was super that could boring. happen, though. Okay. I, never I could see And then, that like, happening. it was this other scene <laughs> at the beginning true? of the movie where, like, the ship carrier just drove into, like, <clears throat> the beach. Drove, oh, my God. Floated into the beach, and everybody was just like, huh, that shit just happened. Let's just go back home and just. Chill and watch TV. And that everything. happens often in real life, though, too. No, no we're gonna talk yeah, about it. Google it. We're gonna YouTube it. But we're gonna talk. YouTube about it. We never it. talk about it. You don't even know about it. <laughs> it happened before. No, listen. Motherfuckers just get drunk or go to bed and they forget to stop the boat and that bitch does it. not make it good. It doesn't. Well, it's in real life. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't make it good I mean, at all. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> that's not well, one good thing I will say about the movie, it was the acting was very good. Yeah. But you got fucking I mean, I was about Ethan Hawke, Mahershala Ali, and I was about Julia to say, you fucking got star Rock, studded. Kevin Bacon. And Kevin yeah. fucking ba- Turkey Bacon. Yeah. What? You got it. You Look. got it. Yo. <laughs> I don't like Yo, that. Yo. Look. What you mean? Look. Okay. Look. Okay. Kevin, Speaking no, of. Oh, 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 hold on. I would want to say one thing. Before. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't watch that movie. Go Damn. Ahead. Thank you. Okay. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I would say for mine, and I had to look it up to make sure, so I'm glad that <laughs> I, I did this. Infinity Pool. Oh, Ooh. Y- yeah, y'all trashed that shit. Ooh. I, that I forgot Damn, about that. Damn, bro. Oh, I can't remember that. I didn't think, I didn't think, I didn't know that that came out in 2023, but God. God. Damn, and that hurt my soul because I love Mia God. Yeah, she God. is, that's yeah, my baby. She's in trouble right now, too. Is she? What'd she yeah, do? She was uh, abusing somebody on set. set yeah. of no, she just kicked somebody and belittled them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That's true. true. That, but that. I would and not pay for her to I'm do not gonna lie, though, to this. I'm not going to lie. She dressed my eyebrows. I'll make her do it. I wouldn't take a. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't take a British person belittling me seriously. She's British. <laughs> yes. I yeah. So she was like, oh, okay. "Yeah, you piece of shit." <laughs> now you give me some tea and crumpets. You smell like bread. <laughs> oh, it's a Tuesday. It's a Tuesday. Hey, sorry, calm down. Down. <laughs> Just calm down. Oh okay, <laughs> it's a Tuesday. You here at work? <laughs> You're here at work. Duh. That's Get home. I forgot so about what, the movie. Okay, so, lady. what about the movie? Didn't you like, bro? Fucking so name it, was, it, bro. <laughs> look, okay, I'm gonna break this movie down for uh, you, please. Okay? okay, so we can waste. We just, some time. yeah, we'll <laughs> waste some time with this. Okay, okay. It's supp- there's definitely it's supposed to it's supposed to be like a metaphor and have some kind of message. Mm. First of all, it's a dude it's a dude and his wife and they end up on some fucking they go go to some island because the wife is rich and the dude is like a struggling writer and they go there and they so he not rich too no he's he's no he wrote one so he wrote my one- girl not rich I'm not rich no you doing it wrong nigga you hustling backwards okay <laughs> anyway <laughs> uh so so he meets this he meet they meet this girl which is mia goth and then her i guess husband or something like that and she recognized him because of his books and SoundCloud right so then they inter- they start hanging out with this couple and then bro this this man is in the forest peeing <clears throat> okay <laughs> because they went off on some like little excursion off away from their resort right she walks <laughs> up behind him and starts jerking him off oh right, this is right. he's not even like hard he's and then it's flaccid like, bro yeah, and then, flaccid, not, and then they show the cum like on a on a leaf yeah he jizzed on the floor so, not then, even a big so then at the end of the Shark night this movie i'm gonna find you at the end of the night they 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 leave he accidentally <laughs> hits some farmer that was crossing the a dirt road in the middle of the night walking out of a cornfield <laughs> he just so walked mad. like oh hey <laughs> and then got hit so then so then farmers be farming mm-hmm. yeah. at night the, look, mia tells him not to not to not to call the cops what's and, her name in the movie i don't remember okay i'm sorry but you're not gonna remember uh, his name in the fucking movie yeah, yeah no i don't remember anyone's name no um but she tells him not to call the cops and then they go back this nigga's nervous because he just killed somebody and blah 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 okay that is fair wakes up the next day the cops are at his door Mm. they snitched on him who snitched I'm about to say yeah and the the other dude fucking so they take him they take him to their thing and then the cop says that you know in in their country, the tradition is to let the oldest son of the person you killed kill you. What? Like, Wait, what country is this? I don't. Some, don't remember. Some All right. Yeah, like, hey, 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 yeah, it's, 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 it's some yeah. Eastern Horrible. European country, but huh? like so. But then they offer. They make an <clears throat> offer where you can, like, basically create a clone of yourself, and the clone can sit in and get killed in your place. 
which is what sparks the whole fucking thing about the movie because all of the people that were there are rich people that are paying to get clones and watching themselves get killed. And like, so that's how they're entertaining themselves. So this is Epstein Island. No, there's it's no not, children. It's just there's no children. Very yeah. and killing. different. Like yeah, <laughs> very different. I just heard an island and white rich people. Just rich people and island. Rich people. Island. Just island. Just island. Island. And then, we, we, but at the end of the thing, like they 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 take a clone, like they end up belittling this guy, and like they end up belittling this guy for his writing and everything like that. Basically, they're trying to get this dude to become a man because he's very emasculated, and so he ends up. Yeah, his at, wife was rich. His wife was emasculating him too, though. Like Damn. in the beginning, he was married to this mixed and, uh, girl or this. Oh, white skinned black lady and she was like yeah you know like i hate my dad so i had to marry a struggling writer just to spite him and then what is it alexander scar is that the white dude that's yeah scar yeah, yeah. Scar. Yeah. Scar. Scar. Yeah. scar uh yeah. quick easter egg he was in atlanta season four he and, was fire yeah and he was getting belittled in there too bro <laughs> he was He's just and he was jerking off in the fucking mirror yeah. bro oh, like, yeah. she was she was like yeah. she was like talking shit about him and then like like so and then she ended up leaving him there because he he want but he wanted to stay because he fell into that trap of like wanting like like they're like weird like cultish like they like watching themselves die so they would like go as a group to watch a group of themselves get murdered. Sounds like this like, would have worked. So they were the Black Mirror episode. It, it would like it would, they were yeah. they were it's committing long, like they were episode. committing crimes on purpose so right. that so that they could watch yeah. this happen. So it really sucked. So, and then at the end of it, like, he ended up having to fight himself and kill himself with his bare hands. Nice. And then all the other, everyone just leaves. They just go home. Like, oh, and that was it. And then they just start talking about their life when they were like, oh, uh, you know, when I get back, I, I hope the cleaners were well. Like, bro, like, oh, fuck you. I was like, all right. <laughs> so that the clones was, that, didn't win. No. Th- no, there were no, the, the clones couldn't do shit. They were just getting creative. Clones just kept uh, getting marked. Okay. Yeah, so it was it was fucking <clears throat> stupid. Yeah. The whole thing was stupid. Nice. Damn it, I forgot which that we watched which, that movie and I forgot I liked, I liked both of those. I liked both of their, like, I liked both of the those people, like, Skarsgård and Mia Goth, yeah. but, like, yeah, both bro, what the fuck? 100%. It was a good Don't do that again. Yeah, don't do that again. Speaking of which, was Pearl last year? Pearl was 2022. Oh, yeah, you're right, because X and Pearl can't. X and Pearl same came year, basically. Same year. Yeah, which was oh, okay. crazy okay. back to back bangers. Yeah. Bangers. Back to back fucking bangers. I only watched the bangers. So, okay. I'm going to fuck up the game with this one. Because if I'm not mistaken, this movie may have came out in 2023. About this is what I was PCU shit. No, no. I was going to say this movie, but then he brought up Infinity Pool. I forgot we fucking watched that bullshit piece of shit fucking movie. I feel like we watched another movie that was like that too, where we were okay, at so the this end one. of the movie, we were like, <laughs> that was a movie. Oh, we watched a lot of movies like though. <laughs> they made that a movie. Been, that might not have been this year. Though. Maybe it was Jason X. Yeah. No, I for the end of that movie. He sucks on so many levels. He, no, he's fuck fucking him. flying into Earth. Are you kidding me? That's so great, dude. He flew out of nowhere. <laughs> Yo, how do you decide the direction you're flying in space? In space. When you just and after anyway. an explosion. All right. All um, right. For me, again, people are gonna get mad. Okay. John Wick Four. Really? Damn. I watch the John Wick. Yeah. Oh wait, actually that makes boring. sense because you said that that you yeah. said you said it was like about and that. so like the fight scenes seemed tired. Like they seemed tired. Like you could tell like they were waiting for him to swing so they could fucking react. Like Bro, fucking like, was like fifty eight. Who early yeah, right. wrestlers? No, I'm talking about the, like the stunt people and all that other shit. Like yeah, he was moving fine, I guess. Yeah. But it's like <laughs> it seemed like they're on the fourth movie and they're like. Can we stop, please? See, I heard well, no because y'all stop. keep watching this shit from like, people that are. I watched it because I heard it get hyped up. Yeah, that's what I. And so I watched it, and then like then I watched David Fincher's The Killer, and I was like, oh, this is far superior. Mm. And no one was talking about The Killer. That's what Michael yeah. uh, Fassbender. Michael Fassbender, Fassbender yeah. where he's that fucking hitman, and like it's this that movie yeah, is fucking it. phenomenal. By the way, this yeah, I gotta I gotta see that. The, the Killer, killer dude, was, the Killer that, was dope, bro. The, the, that movie was so good to me because. One, he doesn't talk in that. Like he he talks when he needs to, so people get really uncomfortable because he's Magneto. He don't need to. Talk. <laughs> no, he don't. Him is Magneto's hot dude. But like in scenes, like so, you know when you're around you're people who feel awkward and silent, so they have to fill the air with some talk. Yeah, I do. They that do that with him, mm-hmm. and then he just kills them. <laughs> but like, yeah, so there are moments that? where you're like, oh, he's not gonna kill them, and then he does. And you're like, fuck, I did not <laughs> think that was gonna happen, <laughs> and it's <laughs> fucking great. There's, Netflix, right? Dude, there's one kill that he does in there. Mm. I was like, best kill of the year, dude. Best fucking kill. I'm not going to spoil it, 
but the killer was it's a slow burn but if you pay attention you're really into it fucking phenomenal yeah but it's david fincher what oh, do you expect? And, and what else about John Wick did you know John Wick about? 4, I was just, it was just like, how long can you drag out this story? And like, you're in the city, you're in a club, everyone's getting shot up, and you hear no police reports, nobody talks about okay. this. Oh. Like, the car chases. This has been going on for, like, at the at the most a year, this whole entire war that okay. one single man's been having with an entire group of higher ups. Over a fucking And poodle. you don't hear anybody talk about it? Nobody's that on shit high alert? Okay. fucking makes me so mad. That's why I fucking hated Bleach. Yeah, How no. the fuck are you fighting in the city? You're destroying the city and there's never anyone outside. Yeah. No cars, you know, no people walking. This, this like, man was <laughs> going up the stairs <laughs> shooting people for like 30 minutes and no one called the cops. Bro, it's like action, bro. <laughs> bro but it, I, but I, think Michael Bay yeah. cares that's about why, reality? Wait. That's why I hate yeah. action. Michael that's Bay. why I really don't like action movies. Like, like yeah. yeah. <laughs> that I, movie was- I really don't like action movies that much because it's like they're my brain is not able to like disregard the realistic the real, see, aspect of it. I mean, like there wrong. needs to be there. If you're doing this shit, there should be casualties ha, outside. Have of you weird... ever seen hardcore Henry? No, I've seen clips from it. That's pretty uh, sick. First person. I'll, first person. It's a first person action movie. And all it is is straight action. Yeah. And, and it's, it's just, it's, it's, it's literally just like a dude wearing a GoPro. Story. That's yeah. what I love about story. like. But that's different. It was like you know, like how like in 2013 or like 16, where them niggas. That's a lot of difference. But them niggas was doing like them parkour shits. Yeah. With them, uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. It's literally yeah. that, but the yeah. nigga got a gun. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. A, I and, love and Frank. Vengeance. I, I've Frank, heard of it. Yeah. I've heard of it. Yeah. Frank. But no, John Wick Four. Until you brought up Infinity Pool, was gonna be mine. Yeah, but I'm running on Infinity Pool because I forgot about that yeah. garbage fucking trash of a movie, bro. That <laughs> garbage. <laughs> look, garbage. look, look. A movie, a movie. Look, I'm gonna tell you guys. If Nick says that a movie is bad, like <laughs> uh, no, no. Let me not, let me not say that. Let me not say that because Nick's tra- Nick's Nick's uh, taste is trash sometimes. Fuck you. If Nick, <laughs> if at the end of a movie, Nick says, "Well, that was a movie." That means that it's really bad because Nick likes bad movies. I love like, bad movies. It's Nick, so good. Nick likes like good Kojima. movies and he likes bad movies. So if he says that was a movie, that means the movie was actually Jason bad. X is phenomenal. Yeah, Jason X is <laughs> fucking horrible. Kevin Fever's up there too. Kevin, Kevin Fever <laughs> with the greatest <laughs> plot in movie. What's history? the rifle for? <laughs> <laughs> Don't say it because we'll get in trouble. Uh, wow, I can say it. You can, again? We've been over this. We okay. can. You can, can say it. We can you beep just it out. Can't say it on the podcast.